Kai Havertz is as divisive as he is because we all watched him for three years at Chelsea and didn't rate him. And we haven't seen that much of him so far at Arsenal. And it's really hard for me to believe that he's somehow going to come good, right? But the difference here is that he costs 65 million. He's probably the, he's probably the yeah, one standout the player. Talking about. No, but if, yeah, exactly. But the, he's a one standout player in the Arteta regime where you go, what the fuck were you thinking? Right? I like, think we all, do. we all, yeah. We did a we did a show about it. In varying, it varying degrees, we all do, yeah. And I and I'm and I'm a fan, re, you know, relatively speaking, but not for sixty five mil. Hey, can um, I just put this on? Because we've got Lee Gunner speaks facts, and it's a shame not to use him. Um, I've just said that um, Kai Habits was a ridiculous uh, signing, like way too much money, and now I'm getting told I'm hyping him up and calling him the next Burkham. Mm. For the record, as if oh, anyone never. ever needed to say this. Kai Havertz is not the next Bergkamp, right? He's no. not the last yeah. Bergkamp. He's not Bergkamp's left boot. He's nothing, right? Nothing like Bergkamp. There is only one Dennis Bergkamp. I've sung that ever since he came from Inter Milan. One Dennis Bergkamp. And it ain't fucking Kai Havertz who's going to replace Dennis yeah. Bergkamp. The there will never be a player been like been Dennis been Bergkamp been again. Was, was yeah, it, was it, when, you, when Johan Cruyff was asked, he said... There isn't an ideal footballer, but when I close my eyes, I see Dennis Bergkamp. Fast forward, there was no world in which Johan Cruyff is saying that about Kai Havertz, right? Like He's not even saying that if he's sleeping with Havertz's mum. Let's stop talking about Havertz in the same breath as Bergkamp. Let's stop talking about anyone in the same breath as Bergkamp, unless it's Diego Maradona or, or someone of that ilk. Because as far as I'm concerned, Dennis Bergkamp was rained down from heaven on us by the <laughs> angels. He was not a normal human being. He's my Blessed favorite. Well, listen, it was, we did get mentioned earlier on, but it was mentioned in conjunction with Jesus, not with, with uh, Havertz. So no matter which way you slice it up, Lee Gunner speaks facts talking shit yet again. Um, no, facts shit. Dennis Borkamp is the greatest Arsenal player of all time. Yeah, He's been saying... Yeah. People say it's Terry, Terry we, Henry. Dennis Bergkamp is the greatest football player Arsenal has ever had. Hey, and that's that's yeah. But he wasn't Simple. there all the time. It's just he was capable of magic. There, yeah. were, there were games where he went missing, um, unfortunately. I think if you asked Thierry Henry, he'd say Dennis Bergkamp was the yeah. best player of all time. I don't yeah. think there's any question about I'll, it.